guys, how are you? It's been a while since I made a personal video and first of all, Happy New Year to everyone! 2021! Sounds good? I hope it's better. Um, actually, I have a funny story and I have some clips because I know you won't believe me when I say those things but trust me, it happened. Okay, <clears throat> uh, get yourselves ready for a funny story that is not so funny. Okay, so in Cyprus and in Greece we have a tradition for New Year's Eve and we make like a, a cake, a certain kind of cake, we call it Vasilobita and we put inside the cake one lucky coin, okay? And when the new year comes, at midnight, we cut the cake in pieces and whoever finds the coin in their pieces, they it means that they are going to be lucky, they are going to have a wonderful year and yeah, you can take your uh, lucky coin and you're like, yes, 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 and you put it on your wallet and you have a good luck all year round. So. I cannot even remember the last time I won the coin. Yeah, I'm not lucky. But this year you won't believe it. You won't believe it. I found the coin in my part, in the cake that I had. Okay? And it was mine for two seconds. Because then my dog ate my lucky coin. Χρονιά πολλά, καλή χρονιά. Συνήθω πρέπει να μου κάνε, ναι. Ναι. Για να δούμε ποιο το βρήκε. Εσύ. Πάει πολύ καλή χρονιά σημαίνει. Πέτο! Πού το! Πέτο! Κοίτα! 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 Only to me, right? Did anybody? Did your dog eat a coin? No, nobody's dog eat a coin. Never mind. We were shocked. We called the vet, and the vet was like laughing, and he told us, "Don't worry, he's gonna poop it soon," and stuff like that. But she never did. She didn't poop it, so we were worried. And we took the dog for an x-ray and I'll put the picture right here to see where my coin is. My lucky coin is on my dog's stomach. Okay, so um, we had a procedure and the vet took out the coin, so I have it now in a bag because it's disgusting. And I put it on my wallet. But let's consider if my year started like this. What's gonna happen next? Like, my dog ate my lucky coin. What's gonna happen next? I don't know, like, earthquake? Uh, I don't know, the end of the world? Be prepared. I told you. So. Um, well, I'm not here to talk about that anymore. I am actually here to share with you something that I'm going to do for the first time in my life this year. And it's called a vision board. For those who don't know what a vision board is, like a board or a wall in my case, where you take would put pictures that you find on the internet or like you edit the pictures that pictures your goals of the year and you put them on a board or your wall and some somewhere that you are gonna see them often for uh, like uh, in my case I'm gonna put them uh, on the wall in front of my bed so every time I woke up I'll be like ah, that's my goals let's do this um, and I know some of you will be like, why would I go find pictures? Why should I print them? Why should I cut them and stick them when I just can't write on my paper the goals that I want for the year? 
and here comes the neuroscience and the psychology and I'm gonna explain you how it's going to work, okay? Uh, the up, up consciousness. I am not an English native speaker, so you know what I'm talking about. Uh, when you see those pictures, your up, up conscious mind doesn't know that that's not the reality. It thinks that what you see on the wall, it's real. It's happened, you know? You're like, she sees a beautiful body and she's like, Oh my God, that's my body. Who, what? I wrote the book? The author is my name? I am author? One million subscriber on YouTube? Seriously? This is your up, up conscious mind because your conscious mind no, that's not true. And the unconscious mind work as if you already have achieved all of your goals that you have set. And I'm gonna tell you an example to explain why it's like important to have them somewhere that you see them often okay so we all have in we have pinterest and i have an album which is outfits and like i save outfits that i like and yeah like that and like maybe i saved them three months ago i i didn't even know that i saved those pictures i, I, I just forgot about them and I went for shopping after three months, uh, for example, and I came back home and I was like, oh, let's check my album in Pinterest. And everything that I bought was the same thing that I've saved on Pinterest three months ago. And I didn't knew it. I, I, I didn't remember it, but my conscious mind put it back there, they saw the pictures and they were like, you already have hers. And then the three months that I got the clothes, they were mine. So this is how your brain works. You can search it, it's true. Neuroscience and psychology, a big love, that's hard. So, um, should I show you some of my goals? I'm, I'm a bit ashamed. <laughs> Actually, I don't know. Should I? Do you want to see it? Don't, don't dare smile, okay? I said big goals. That's what you should do too. Not small goals, big ones. Let's see some of them. Yeah. Uh, They're not, uh, I'm gonna cut them later and you're gonna see the final result on my wall because nobody likes seeing people cutting a paper. It's not fun. It's not something that you wish to see. So, okay, let's start with the body shape. Well, I'm pretty skinny. So, some muscles will be great. Okay. Oh, ooh. You believe on see. This is have a double meaning. I want to learn French and I want to travel to France. And this is Emma Watson uh, speaking to a crowd. I would love to do that. The dream big. I know you're laughing. You don't believe me. I don't believe me either. But we'll see. Okay. So, next. All right, so we have a violin because I'm starting lessons again. When I was young, I used to play violin, but then I stopped. So this year I'm gonna start again. So that's a violin and this is German because I want to go to Germany and I also want to know German. And I thought, well, You'll be like, you're gonna learn French and German in one year. 
And like, hold on, my plan is to watch as many movies as possible in French and German because that's how I've learned English. So I'm gonna watch a lot of movies and series and hope I learn the language somehow. You have to be positive. You have to be positive. You have to have a positive attitude. Don't diminish your goals. Another thing. The girl is violent. Okay, and here comes the the uh, writing thing. Uh, it says, if you don't see the book you want, I don't know, you want on this shelf, write it. Um, here we can see some... some camping, adventures. I want to live adventures with my friends easier. And then here it's, it's for the writing again. Either write something worth reading or do something worth, worth writing. So yep, yeah, that's and this one is again friendship and it's just two girls because I like small um, companies. I prefer like to have only one person in front of me instead of a lot. I'm an introvert. Another friend here talking about the stars in the sky. Mm. Um don't laugh. Don't laugh. 1 million subscriber read my channel and then that's my boyfriend my future boyfriend because I don't have one and then this is the book that I wrote not yet but I'm going to see the author is my name isn't it amazing go to your bookstore and buy my book you won't find it because I didn't write it yet but I'm in the middle of it so stay tuned and I have another six cents just to okay that's, that's my vision board for now maybe I'll see some more later but you get the point what you have to do and why you have to do it so see you later in a bit actually when I put them on my wall and see you later bye Hello guys, I just finished with my vision board, as you can tell, it's a vision wall actually. <laughs> um, it's opposite my bed, so I'm gonna see it, this picture like every day for the rest of the year. And also I would love to see your vision board, so I have my Instagram in the description down below. And see you in another video! Bye!